Hey everybody! Uh, Steve's out of town right now, so I got myself somebody who is actually funny. Uh, <laughs> welcome, Brian! Hello! Uh, today we are playing Return of the Obra Dinn, and Brian will be controlling it. Oh. Um, so, is that why they've got the controller? Uh, I believe that's why. Right. I don't know, I get confused. Um, <clears throat> so, feel free to start. Okay. Uh, do you want to give any preface to this, or are we just going to jump in? Uh, we're just going to kind of jump in. This is like a mystery game thing. Uh, is it working? Is the controller not working? <laughs> it is not. Oop. Uh, oop. Is there maybe options? You, like, up there we go. Hey, there we I go. I think it's because okay. I accidentally might have clicked off. So, uh, All right. <coughs> Lost at Sea, 1803. The good the ship, ship Obra Dinn. <clears throat> Built in 1796 London. 800 tons, 18 foot drive. Oh, this is London. I should like give like a really bad Cockney accent. Well, I also like if it's built in London, it should be T O N N S. T O N N S. Yeah, don't uh, don't they? I thought they had an E like T O N E S. T O N N E S. Yeah. Tones. Tones. It is 800 tones. Oh, okay. I guess we're done with that. We're done. The Honorable East India Company. Oh, okay. Attention, Chief Inspector. Insurance and claims London office. The Obra Dinn has returned. Dispatch to Falmouth Falmouth. immediately. Falmouth? Falmouth? Falmouth immediately. And prepare to meet a full assessment. All righty. Falmouth, England. 1807. So this is... Oh, oh, we don't have to do voices. Uh, Not for this, at least. Yes, please. Not many eager for that job. Including this one. Mm Mm-hmm. Seems a bit late if you are. Didn't. No. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and I'm a woman, apparently. <coughs> yeah. I don't know. Wait, what? Hoist it up in a few minutes. Hey. What? How? Uh, with your arms? Carefully. Oh my god, she's my I dad. Am, I am sassy. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, so, this is you. This is me. Look around. And you're in control now. Wow. Such beautiful star night, starry night. Well, it's it's and amazing graphics. Well, I I like the fact that it's so simplistic, but it, it gets the the detail across. Because like the, down on the horizon, there's a clear night stars. Like none of these are actually stars, but you get the idea. Yeah, it's it's like a cloud. It's like a kind of a clear night, but with a little bit of clouds in it. All right. So All right. I've been playing a lot of Destiny Two lately. Uh huh. So forgive me. If I try doing anything super silly. Oh, this is... What, okay, what, what so, silly things could you possibly oh, do? Okay, there we go, climbing. By the way, so you're playing Destiny 2. Mm-hmm. Um, what do you think about the new expansion? I uh, actually haven't gotten into it yet. I, oh, I okay. am very far behind. I played a lot on the PlayStation 4 when it first mm-hmm. came out. I have a couple of friends who, who work there, and so they convinced me to finally play. Um, I'm just going to take this in real quick. Mm. Those are some tattered sails. Very neat. It's, uh, very disorienting now, but very neat. Disorienting how? Uh, so like the lines kind of cut in front of each other, and it's it's hard to get uh, oh. vector vector depth. Oh yeah yeah yeah. It, it, it's it's very uh, stylized. Oh. Oh, it's something. I uh, bet that won't come into play later. No. Poss- right. n- impossible. Um. Uh, yeah, it's very interesting because it's like uh, black and white, so it's like it takes shading and like uh, negative space. Okay, I to I want interesting degree. I want my stuff hoisted. Oh well, you gotta. How, you how do I hoist? Uh, I believe he has to do the hoisting. Uh, he hasn't even moved. All right, he's cool. Uh, I believe gonna... we're supposed to just like monitor the deck right eh, now. And... I'll just take it all in. What is is that like a speaking tube? I think so. Yeah. Huh. Uh, so yeah. The uh, fun fact: they actually used to do that kind of crap. Like they they had the tubes that ran all the way through, and uh, they yell at each other. And... Interesting. Uh, I never realized that like a uh, like in the 1800s or whatnot, like old timey ships, and I guess even today. Um, but they had speaking tubes. Like I thought that was like a a, a submarine thing. <laughs> uh, um, you know, and and don't quote me on this, uh-huh. but I think it started off with uh, they just had ventilation tubes, and somebody figured out that you could you know shout through them. Oh, okay, that and makes so sense. So it just started becoming a a thing. But yeah. like I said, I I have no idea if that's true or not. Oh, oh. hey, hey, buddy. Oh, there's a sparkly thing, but 
there's but a, there's dead, a dude. dead guy. But there's a ah, sparkly, dead sparkly dead or dead. Uh, oh well, nothing, nothing happened here. Oh, oh, I can zoom in. Oh, I have. Oh, this feels lie. disrespectful. Okay. Oh, uh, Let's see. Got? Yeah, I'm just I'm. <laughs> for, for being an investigation thing, she's she seems very uh, nonplussed about anything going on right now. I mean, she is English. And the English people tend to have like a, that weird sense of like. Oh. oh okay. It's too heavy. Okay. You're you're what? Okay. It's too heavy. You're too heavy. Um. But yes. All right. So I believe. Uh, yeah, like the English, oh, English okay. people have like that, uh, that, that like. Um, I have five different ways to zoom in. All right. I mean, you might need all of them. I mean, it's too heavy, but oh, oh, that's my arm. Okay. So I believe you can reach out and uh, wherever, like you touch, like I guess there's like an interact button. Yeah. I don't know. I'm just not on, sure on if I'm the, supposed to go. On the computer, it's just a, like a left click. It's too uh, heavy. Okay, I, 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 Lift it I believe you. Okay. Whatever, okay, bro. I'm gonna, I'm gonna come back down then. Um, but they have that, like, like, I don't know, sense of decorum where they're like, oh, we can't be, like, brought to be impressed or whatever. Take it yourself or open it here. Uh, uh, oh, okay. Oh, oh. oh, I don't want to open it here. Ooh. I want to take it myself. Well, too bad. Okay. That's a book. Mmm. <laughs> I like that we are discovering this in real time. She's just like, book. Yes. All right. Catalog. Yes, yeah, the catalog is spelled with the uh, the U. Uh, Interesting. Yeah. Yui. Yui. Uh, the Gui. I trust that you now find yourself hey. aboard the Oprah Din. I expected this day to come, and my every intention was that to tell the ship's strange tale within the pages of this book. Regrettably, failing health has allowed me to produce only the basic outline that follows. Your presence on the Oberdin is critical. I leave the discovery of its fate and the completion of this book in your hands. The following, the next few pages will seem <laughs> bewildering at first. All will make sense in time. I could make it make sense, but, but where's the fun in it. that? <laughs> uh, use the pocket watch to determine the identity and fate of everybody aboard. Complete each chapter <laughs> accurately and return the book. By guaranteed post to the French Office of Affairs in Morocco. The bargain charter <laughs> will remain unknown to you. I possess the details within, but have elected to keep them private for now. <laughs> J Henry J the Douchebag Evans. I have elected to keep them private for now for funsies. I'm, uh, so, okay. Yeah. General idea. Got it. Use the pocket watch to determine the identity. How? I... You, you'll, you'll find I out. I desperately hope. You, you'll, uh, you'll, uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. They'll, they'll tell me. Okay, what do we... All right, so here's the journey uh, from the art... Oh, hello. Oh, okay. Okay, so apparently we... Ah, oh, Cape Verde. Mm, Cape Verde. It's one of my um, favorite dishes. Uh, green chili <laughs> on... Uh, uh, on uh, a cape. On, on capers. On capers. <laughs> and then the cape Canary Islands, Bay. the only place where you can get canaries. And hide a lot of money. Oh, yeah. And Madeira, where uh, I believe they make some really good wines. And terrible movies. Mm. So here is the, the Orlop deck? Uh-huh. What, what is an Orlop deck? Uh, It's where they store the Orlops. Mmm. Then Orlop storage <laughs> containers. Oh, there's a surgery bin and a crew quarters. Uh huh. So cargo Orlop. Cargo Orlop. The gun deck I I know as also being the midship deck. Oh, look uh, at you. Also, I believe called the tween deck occasionally because it's the between. The, is that the, where the like top deck and the? Is that like where like the adolescents and the teens <laughs> become? It's where. It's where you you learn to drink mm -hmm. and begin hating life. Oh, it's it's where that every, every young person learns to start hating life. Oh, okay. Uh, at a young um, age. Okay. Uh, the Lazarette. The Lazarette. Excellent. All right. So, Captain's. Uh, Barger we now know everything about what the ship is. Okay. Uh, let's see. Okay, the crew. So we have a crew manifest. Oh, do I have to? <gasps> oh. oh! 
Who oh. is Robert Witt? Oh my God! Winero. How many people do they have on the? Who? I wonder who this guy is. Uh, he got. He's he's Mr. Dead. He then got. Fuck. He did. Don't get fucked. Justice at sea. F- Forsman royalty. I like. I like that it's in quotes as if they know. Like yeah, <laughs> yeah justice. justice. <laughs> get it? Yeah. All right. Uh, so, so apparently third, fourth mate, really? So yeah, it looks like um, you find out the the fate of everybody. There's a lot of mates on this. There's, I I feel like this. There's there's too many mates for this not to be. Uh, he has a ton of stewards as well. The, all the mates have stewards. Yep. Yeah. This is a this is a English this, <laughs> this is an English <laughs> ship. Check it out. We've got top men on it. Oh, we got many <laughs> top men. All right. Can we right now, yes. here and now, look me in the eyes? Yeah. We will not make the obvious semen jokes. No. Can we do that? Oh. We can try. Let's let's. Can we? Can but we? I don't put know a timer? if I could swallow we, that. Oh God! <laughs> Damn it! All right, <laughs> call it now. Yep. Uh, ten minutes into the episode, uh, five, first five semen s- joke. Five seconds into seeing the word semen. Yep. All right. <laughs> All right. Midshipman. New Guinea. All right, so we okay. have uh, everybody there. Uh, there's the sketches from so there, the wife. Yeah, that's the the picture that we saw earlier. Yeah. All right, uh, so we have uh, loose cargo. Oh, uh, isn't that what they called my first girlfriend? Uh, you know what? God bless you, because I was gonna make the ex girlfriend joke, and then <laughs> I realized that I've made that joke way too many times lately, uh-huh. and so I I didn't want to make it again. Don't worry, I can only use you. that like a handful of times, given the amount of women that I've been with. So that's I might as well get them in while I can. Uh, that's what she said. Okay. Isn't that cool. what he said? Uh, Get it in while I can. I don't know. You know. It's, I mean, if you're gonna play, you if know, you're just a tip. If you, if you're gonna peg it, then yeah, you might as well. So All right, it's a lot of blank pages. I have a feel. Okay, I'm. I'm yeah, so you want to just hold it down? Uh, oh, hold the right I, I do down. actually have to go through all of this. Uh, yes. So this Holy is the one thing I do cool. know. So cool. that's the reason why they do this. This chapter will remain unknown until you leave the ship and return the book to me. How? How is it going to be known if I ship the... I begin to think Because he, this is the ship's bargain. I begin to think he has not thought this all the way through. Oh, no, he, he has. And his way of thinking it through is, I'm an ass, and I'm going to just leave a mystery because, you know, I want to have mystery. Because mwahaha. Yeah, exactly. Okay. All right, so that's basically it. So now you know everything inside Gloss- there. You can see the glossary. It'll automatically move you to the correct pages for it. And it'll give you definition terms. Seaman, low-level crew member responsible for general manual labor on the below deck. Oh. On and below deck. Whatever. Oh, whatever. Doesn't matter. God, they even they 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 put the word below in the description about seaman. Like, yep. They. Mm. Yeah, uh, they they had to get it in there. Uh, and then it'll if you right click it, it'll uh, show you the uh, way to open the book and to go to the table of contents and close it, so that way okay. you can just be done with this. Excellent. Okay. There's and that. Here's the the death watch. Yes. Here's the magic watch. The memento, memento mortem. mortem. Hey, that's cool. That's actually uh uh, that's in the Kingdom Death game. What, the memento, memento mortem. mortem? Mm-hmm. Really? Yeah. And does it allow you to remember death? Kind of. It, it's it's the memento mori, which uh, is uh, death pictures. Oh, so okay. You paint a picture of the dead people. Oh, okay. Which becomes very cluttered very quickly in Kingdom Death. Peace out, bro. All right. All right, so we now know. How is that too heavy? <laughs> Sorry. It, no, Sorry. it was the case. Because the case is designed to hold the magic watch. And so they don't <laughs> want it to jostle around, so they over engineered it, obviously. I, I'm going to suspect that you are making excuses for the game. I most definitely <laughs> am. And in the next episode, I will make even more excuses. Don't, don't, don't. What? We're. No, uh, uh, no, uh, uh, fine. No, all right. Bye, everyone. Bye, bye.